All right. What's up, everybody? Yep. I saw this game. I was like, this looks cool. I looked at reviews online, and people were saying it's like Undertale and shit. So that's as much as I have to go off of. I saw a bit of the trailer. I don't want to get like super spoiled. If it is like Undertale, it means it's going to be like based on choices and stuff. Um, do it in in to do it in my native language of Chinese. No. Um, surprised they don't have like Spanish. They have English, French, Japanese, Chinese, and I'm not sure which one this is. The the characters do not look like Korean, and that's definitely not a Korean flag. It might be like Vietnamese or something. Either way, uh, yep, this is Everhood, uh, kind of just decided to think maybe it's only 10 bucks on Steam, and it might be something fun to start up. The only thing I saw was uh, Kermit the Frog playing on a banjo, so already I am, I am hooked just based on the trailer. So this is like, not a rhythm game, but like a, a rhythm platforming game, as far as I can tell, with like some RPG elements. It's weird. It's a trip. An ineffable tale of the inexpressible divine moments of truth. Okay, this, this sounds like a trip already. Press A button? Question mark? Like, I'm already scared. Um... Controls. All right, that is a controller. Um, there's move and there's jump. Oh, jump is the triggers. Or left. Oh no, that's move. Sorry, jump is a button. Okay, or up. Interesting. Select. Okay, that's gonna be a thing. Interact button is also a. So really, you only use like one button. Two buttons. Okay. Let's, I guess, start. Oh boy, they give us difficulty. Even faster life regeneration and extra health for people not used to playing video games and more interested in the story. Really? They put very easy on as story mode? Even faster life regeneration. Oh, I guess that's... Faster life regeneration recommended if you don't like losing but still prefer some challenge. Okay. Stories like I'm just in it for the story. I get it. That's interesting. Makes winning feel good. You will die. Less health regeneration for people who like hard challenges. Um. I am a tryhard. Did I just go this on expert to start? I'm tempted. You know, we're going to try expert, and we're going to work our way down the difficulty if it if it gets too hard. If it's, like, impossible for me to beat. But these, it can't be that bad. I'm not great at rhythm, but I'm great at, like, avoiding stuff and reacting because I play fighting games. But it can't be that bad, right? Right? I don't like that ominous laughter. Oh, this is like some Earthbound shit right now. Hello. We are delighted to see you. To enter this realm, you must leave your humanity. Abandon your idea of time and accept immortality. You can leave and return as you will, compared to your current life where there is only one way out. You agree to abandon humanity, time, and accept immortality? No. What happens if I say no? It'll probably just throw me out. We're just gonna do that. No. Understood. We will be here. Hope to see you when you are ready. Yeah, it just throws me out of the game, doesn't it? Yeah, okay. I mean, yeah. That's... That's an answer to a no, I guess. It doesn't shoehorn you into playing the game. All right. Welcome back. It's not an easy decision to abandon your humanity. Oh, they know I'm back now. It's, so it is one of those games. 
This world is hard and ruthless. You must be prepared. For this will be a great trial. Do you agree to abandon humanity time and accept immortality? Yes. Excellent. Like the human world, we have blurred the lines of purpose, but the road is clear. It's, after all, for your own amusement. Alright, anybody who's got epilepsy probably shouldn't be watching this. I can tell right now. Is that Gino? I think it's Gino. It's it's red Gino. Gino couldn't be in Smash, so he made his own indie game. something. Alright. So I'm like... Street Gino. Interesting. Let me back my stuff. Oh, there's Kermit. All right, <laughs> there's only one voice I can do for this. It seems like the wooden doll has started walking. I didn't think you would wake up. Yay. Hmm. Seems you are missing an arm. I cannot let you pass until I know I can. you can fend for yourself. Uh-oh. We're going right into it. Okay, yep. Jump and left and right. Uh oh, should have jumped that one. Okay. I can't just hug a rail. They thought about that. Still have to kind of jump to the beat a little bit if you're, if you're avoiding it. Ah, I jumped too early there, and I jumped too early there. Shit. Already, this is getting a little. I can see myself not being good at this. And Kermit knows how to strum. jump right away on some things. Oh well, my health recovers over time at least. That's good. Ah, uh, I couldn't like zip across. Oh yeah, you can use up to, to do the jump. That wasn't too bad. I survived. It seems you can handle yourself. Oh, one thing before you leave. Make sure you to interact with that lamp to save your progress. Huh? I'm awake. Talk to me to save. Ah, guess it is a lamp. Hey, buddy. You want to save? Yes, magical talking lamp post. Nice. Good luck with whatever you're doing. Thank you. What a nice, what a nice lamp post. I'm sure I will see him again, since he is my save point. Alright, we gotta get this other Super Mario RPG looking motherfucker. Get my stuff back. 
Oh no, we're head heading to the club. Yep. ATM. Hi, fancy seeing you here. You can save your progress here. Do you want to save? Yes. Uh, that was a short. That was a short save point. From another save point. You must have schmuckles to enter. Twenty schmucks go to the ATM machine. Uh, I'll go to ATM machine. Oh, you can double tap to run. Uh, you go around. Welcome to the automated terror machine. Would you like to withdraw schmucks? Oh, terror machine, yeah. Okay. Yes. In order to withdraw schmucks, you must insert your... Soul. Yup. I can, I can already see the Undertale comparison. Hi. Oh, it's an ATM. Why do I have a feeling this is gonna be harder? song. Kind of just electro beat, but it makes sense from a ATM. I was waiting for that middle one to hit the last second. Okay. No schmuckle currency is currently available. Please receive a complimentary schmuckle ticket instead. Okay. You found a schmuckle ticket. A green paper that has schmuckle written on it. Okay. Well, surely I can get in with the schmuckle ticket. You have smuggled ticket, I take ticket. Okay. You can come in. Thank you, pink rock man. I'm so tired of having to work in loud environments like these. But you gotta do what you gotta do until you're done. That's what it's all about, right? I forgot I was what I was talking about. VIP card you have allowed VIP only. Okay. Oh boy. It's Nightman and boxers. Knight lost a lot. Gold pig has made me work so much. Now I just want to have a good time and relax. Yes. Red dead mushroom. We mushroom people usually play in the woods. You should come visit someday. We love to play hide and seek, but nobody wants to be the seeker. Maybe someday. Yes. Oh shit, I skipped that. Yep, you talk too much. Uh, who else do we got? This man whose nose is drippy. Nose Farachu? Uh, 
You get it? It's like a sneeze. You usually don't come to social places like these. They usually don't like bright lights. They usually don't have anything to do. Choo. Sorry. But I think it's good to like to give things another chance. Okay. Hey man, you came out to a party. Live a little. I'm not really a great dancer. But I like seeing people enjoy themselves. Someday I might try dancing. Uh-oh. You desecrated a two million schmuck trick. What do you have to say for yourself? You don't seem to understand what you've gotten yourself into, kid. I am a VIP, and hoodlums like you are not going to get away unpunished. Okay. I guess we got another fight versus a cool dude. Like, Zombietron. dancing. Oh, they got walls now. Shit. Can't jump over those ones. Mad broke his glasses. Now it's getting harder. Yeah. You are faster than I thought. But I have not unleashed one of my strongest attacks. Uh oh. No one has survived my famous. Marathon red death technique. Oh shit, that sounds like a freaking JoJo's attack. Marathon red overdrive. I got the rhythm on this one.
guessing they want me to cross over. Let's really focus in on that. Those two. Oh. Uh. Okay, never mind. That was it. That wasn't so bad. This is expert mode, apparently. Ugh, I am so burned out. Pick up a VIP card, press Y to open inventory, yeah. Luxurious card with the letters VIP. The backside says Ventriloquist Improvisers Puppeteers Club. C is silent, okay. Hi there, dollface. How did you lose your arm? Sorry, that might be too personal. My condolences, my memory chips have not been working well lately. But some say ignorance is bliss. Do you need a drink? Yes. Wait, sorry, we are out of stock. I keep forgetting that. Okay. The FB card you have. Looks good. Tastes bad. Um, good luck. Oh, you're a VIP? Nice. You can save your progress here. You want to save? Yes. Huh. There's music coming from over here. But I can't go anywhere. Oh yeah, I guess I can, sort of. Oh, I see. I gotta probably do Simon Says. Ugh, this melody is so haunting. I love it. Oh, I see. So it's, uh, it's only three notes. Got it. Well, okay then. It's dark, it's cold. But I'm always here to light up the p p path. Do you want it to save? Yes. Game s s saved. What a... What a personality to give. A, a light post. Ah oh, shit, it's... Big Thanos pig. Who let you in here? It's the doll I stole the arm from. Well, well. Did you come here to get your arm back? Ha, ha, ha. You won't. You should have caught your thief when you had the chance. You will only be an annoyance if I keep you around. It's better to get rid of you. We're in the trash. Oh, I see. This is a... uh -oh. It's the incinerator. And all this smoke. Shit, I need to step down. I'm using the D-pad, not the not the analog stick. Oh, you can run. Ah, I see. Well, I'm dead. Okay. I didn't realize I couldn't jump in this. So there's that. The 
really drawn out game over. Or maybe that was supposed to kill me. It looks like I can dodge things. I'm on a screen. This is team scripted. Going through space. Oh shit. It's Soul Kermit. Oh, I gotta fight for my life. What the heck is that? Got a little hand puppet. how reincarnation works. This is interesting. I'm trying to look at the visuals while also not dying. It's hard. Cool though. I dig it. Uh, I died in the death scene. Okay, yeah. Retry from last checkpoint or just retry. Does retry start me over at the save point, I'm guessing? better before. I should just stay in the middle on this song. Maybe not. Jazz, it's too sporadic. Alright, I think I beat it. Yeah. We survived death. Well, I guess that incinerator bit was, uh, was scripted. I wonder if there is actually a way to survive it, though. Alright. We are at... Star Road. Ah. Oh. That looks like a weapon. Oh, it's a person. Really? My Sharona? What's this frickin' beat? They're gnomes. Why, why, are they, why are they playing tennis with gnomes' heads in the background? What the hell? That's graphic. Oh, 
Oh, this is distracting as hell. Okay, I don't like this. This is gonna mess with my brain. I have to wonder how this looks on stream, if it's like looking crisp or if it's like so weird that it's like artifacting at points. I can't really check the analytics to see how many frames are being dropped right now, but... Is that? I I don't understand what's going on. That's probably gonna be just this game in a nutshell. Oh no! Oh no! I don't like this! Please don't do that again. Oh no, it's still doing it, isn't it? Nope. Okay, we're back to clowns. Or whatever the hell these things are. Ah oh, shit, that was... That was a railroad. I need to her recover. Now it's legit artifacting on purpose. It's running on freaking Internet Explorer. Oh, I, I don't like this. It's a good thing I don't get motion sickness because this would probably make me sick. And I apologize if anyone watching this would would have motion sickness. Trish probably not as bad as the one playing it. This is trippy as fuck. Oh no, it's reversed. Uh, no, please. Do this to me. Oh, that's it. Okay. What are you doing here? You know, I'm gonna move the camera a little bit. Hold up. So that it matches this little uh, thing. You don't need to see much of me. This is This game is a spectacle on its own. I'm not that special to look at compared to this. So just to... Hold up. Just this a bit. There we go. There's me. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here. Seems you have returned early. This shouldn't be possible. Something is amiss. Not allow you to learn too much interfere with your purpose. I will restore your body to before you started to, um, drift away. I suggest you continue with what you were doing, but be careful. I could give some advice that would help you, but it's a secret that must stay between us. If you want, I'll give you an absolute truth. This is certainly not the right way to do it. It might help you. Or it might horribly twist you. You wish to hear the absolute truth? Yes? 
There are many absolute truths, but one of them is... Nothing is lost. Once life is death, there will be a... I, I'm just gonna be reading this now in that freaking. There is no such thing as a coincidence, guy. Th that's that's who's talking right now. Once life is death, there will be a transfer you cannot be a part of. The departed will wait for you in a place with no time. Hard choices will be justified in the end. There will be a reconciliation, no matter how ugly. Take this truth. It is now in your hands to interpret its meaning. Now you must continue. Okay, I got an achievo for that. Oh, restore your body to right before you died. Okay, so <coughs> if you die, you just have to go through hell and back to, to resurrect. You will find what you are looking for. Or maybe it's just the first time. <coughs> or maybe this was scripted. Looks probably scripted. I don't know. All right, well, there's a little ladder. Go up the ladder. I bet this was made in Game Maker, like Undertale was. Or RPG Maker, or what? I think Undertale used Game Maker, yeah. It's that guy. Wow, hey. So, the old pig stole my legs. Yeah, they're de detachable, just like your limbs. I can't believe you survived Incinerator. No one has ever survived it. Please take me with you. I'll help get your arm back from the gold pig. Just don't leave me. I'm gonna leave you. You wanna help me get back your arm and my legs? Yes. Thank you. I weigh almost nothing, so you won't even notice me. Gold pig escaped through the magical door. Okay. Shame it's not like Undertale where you can just observe a bunch of stuff and it tells you description descriptions because that's some of the best text. Hey, I'm just a door. I don't have a lot of responsibilities besides standing here. You really want to go after a big guy like that? I was impressed that they even got through me. Of course, World Pick has magic to make it easier, but I imagine them having to fit through all the doors in the world. Maybe you should reconsider. After all, you are only searching for your arm. You seemed helpless to do anything about it last time anyway. Although, you did survive the incinerator somehow. No one else has done that. The corpses around you are proof of that. Oh damn, I didn't even notice. That's like some graphic pixel shit right there. Very subtle. Looks like a freaking ultrasound of like people being dead. Stop stalling and let us pass. Jeez, okay. Cranky gnome. I fancy seeing you here. You can save your progress here. Yep. Okay. Nice. Look with whatever you're doing. Alright, I guess we have options for doors. We got funky door, we got blue door. We got green door, Shrek door, we got chain door, we got game show door. This is just empty. Um, I'm guessing these are all different levels, so I can probably tackle them in whatever order I want. Let's pick blue door first. Uh, nope. Blue door is empty. Maybe there's only one right answer. Oh, hello. What is this weird statue? Has it always been here? There are pieces missing. Well, maybe I have to go through every door. Ah, cool. <laughs> I'll keep holding right. I want to see what happens. Nope, nothing. It doesn't make me go anywhere. 
Okay. Shrek door was spooky laugh. Oh, that looks like a school bus. Okay. Weird. Huh. Stop right there, Red Hood. Ah, yes. I have been sent by Gold Pig to stop you from reaching the Cursed Castle. I order you to stop your quest at once. He's got a helmet on, so like realistically I should be like talking through a cup. Go back where you came from and I won't hurt you. Like that effect. But nah. I'm not gonna do that. Because it sounds stupid. Uh... Go back. Ha ha! Never come back, you foul creature. Back again, huh? Go back to where you came from and I won't hurt you. Okay. I'm gonna go back and see what happens. I probably have to deal with all these people. I want to see what other doors there are. Door is locked. Alright, let's go through carnival door. Come in and experience the race of your lifetime. Ah. The race. Oh, it's Kermit. Another Kermit. Oh no, it's just luck. Wow, look at them racers. Uh... What voice should I do with this guy? Wow, look at them racers go. Someday I hope to win. My sibling is more into fantasy games. Much as I love my sibling. That can be a bit much sometimes. Ha <laughs> ha. Good to have some space every now and then. Give some time to miss each other a bit. Don't get me wrong though. I wouldn't do anything for them. I would do anything for them. Okay. Anything more you gotta say? No. Sign reads double tap direction to run. Hey, my eyes are up here, pal. Wow, okay. Interesting. That's that person. What is the point of learning new skills? You just get bored and forget all that knowledge over time. Maintaining your driving skills, for example. Does anyone get out of that anyway? I guess when it comes down to it, I need to stop thinking about the future. Enjoy what's in front of me instead of what's ahead. I have to treat my life like I'm going through a cave full of gems. Try to collect as many as I can. Otherwise, what's the point? Please, take this. Okay. Spooky. Magic 8-ball. Talk to him. Oh, he has little quips to say about places. Neat. Wow, what a crazy place. How come I never been here? You shake the magic eight ball, it says you have abandoned humanity and accepted immortality. Never forget. Twenty-eight souls are left. Uh okay. Hi, ho, welcome, welcome. I am Cassius. Come and run my humble obstacle course. It ain't much, but it's something. Hi. I will reward you with something yummy. If you beat a universal record. I don't know what accent this is supposed to be, but that's fine. You want to run the obstacle course? Yes, exciting. Make sure to stretch. He's kind of half German. It's ready. All right, obstacle course. Oh shit, I got stuck. Doesn't let me input like multiple at once. And I get snagged around corners. <laughs> like that. I 
this engine was meant to do this. <sighs> Congratulations! You beat the record! Receive your award outside of the course. We're just going full German now. Hi ho, well done! You will be rewarded with a homemade delicious cake. Not sure if you're capable of digestion since you're made of wood. But maybe you can give it to a friend? I like him as German, that makes more sense. He's a German vampire guy. Picked up a cake. Okay, we got cake. Plastic cake. Looks delicious, but it seems inedible. Okay, so it's made of plastic. These people are weird. Is this another VIP dude? Talk to Robot first. Hi there, Red Rider. Can you smell the gasoline? Can you feel the thrill? Are you getting pumped? Do you want to participate in the race? Yes. How exciting. Let us get you a cart. Welcome all racers. Tonight and all other nights. We will race until the end of time. Okay. Oh boy, this is a freaking racing game. Oh boy. Now we're playing racing game. Interesting. Climbing through the ranks. Actually, that was a robot. Should have read it like robot. Shit, if I touch the side, I just immediately slow down. Crap. Oh, now I fucked up. Crap, I can't hug the wall. Too much. Red is falling behind. Yes, I I, I am. Alright, I suck at this. It's getting more narrow. Fuck. I was doing so good. And just like Mario Kart, you get hit once and it's just the end for you. Until you get a blue shell, which I don't have access to blue shells. Final lap. Well, I'm not gonna make first at this point. Red is falling behind. No, I'm not, I'm actually... Okay, now I might be, because... Drifting is hard. Zig. They play dirty. Uh oh. Oh well, he's back in front. Okay, well, second place. Silver's not bad. Oh, this is very, very Mario Kart sounding. <laughs> Now it's Mario Kart 8 sounding.
I have to keep playing until I get first. No. Bell raced. You keep practicing. You might get first place someday. What do I get for first place, though? Yes, let's try to get first. Now I gotta know. Mini games. It's actually a pretty fun racing game, though. You know, racing mini game. It's probably gonna get harder once I actually get to first. Why do I start at the very end? Fine night for racing. Yes, it is, robot. Dig is taking an early lead. Alright, got the hang of this now. Oh, okay, I can smack him in the back, and it actually hurts him. Nice, okay, I need to do that more. Red is climbing through the ranks. So I should have been doing that all along. I was afraid it was going to hurt me. Most of our racers have completed the first lap. Watch out for Zig. They play dirty. This race is mine, Red. I don't know why I gave him, like, fancy man voice. Red is taking the lead. Alright. What an exciting race. Will Zig's reign be ended? Yes. Fuck sick. Pretty far ahead of Zig, I'm sure, so. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. Okay then. Congratulations on finishing in first place. Here is your trophy. Picked up a trophy. Big metal cup with the number one written on front. Okay. I guess that's it. Only VIP allowed. Oh, no need to eat. I know the taste. Alright. That's more like it. Now that's a movie. Hello. I sometimes come here to relax. I can just get my mind, let my mind wander a bit and forget about it all. Sorry. Here comes my favorite part. It's just white noise. Wow, that was cool. Great that I got to share it with you, stranger. Nice. That, that's it.
Surely there's more in here. Okay. I guess it's just a bit. No exit or anything. What is up? Okay. Oh, I gotta be running. Alright. You had a good time, fellas. Alright. Wait. Wait! This is not the door we came in from. Uh-oh. Quite a fall. Yes. Now we are in Shrek Swamp. Picked up a shiny gem. Door is locked. this. Yeah. You found my eye? Please give it to me. Yes, I am. Finally restored. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. I can't believe you, of all people, saved me. What's that supposed to mean? Are you here as well, little red nose? Aiding my, the enemy? What? The enemy? The enemy is gold pig. Because, oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Ha 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 ha. I might have been lost in the woods for ages. But you are the one who's truly lost. Anyway, I am not without honor. You have helped me. So I am in your debt. Now that my vision is restored, I can use my magic. You seem to be missing an arm. Maybe I can help. By removing this giant boulder in your way. Hmm. Should we teleport it away? Destroy it? Why not transform it? Ha ha ha! Ooh. Oh, how delightful. That may transform the giant rock into a clay pot. Ha ha ha! I will now consider the debt repaid. I am now, th or I'm still thankful for you bringing my, re my eye red. I will remember that. Don't expect me to do any, like, real consistent voices at 2 a.m. You found a clay pot. Yay. What's clay pot do? A fire pot made of clay. Okay. Hey, hold on. Now that the debt has been repaid, you're still the enemy. Great, I gotta fight this guy. Hold up, I gotta go to the bathroom real quick.
You're still the enemy. To you in such a weakened state. It would be unfortunate if I didn't. Exploit the situation. <clears throat> Rip my throat. Shit, we're just starting right into it. I was drinking, man. That wasn't cool. Do the skulls kill me instantly if I touch them? Hope not. Shouldn't stay there for too long. <laughs> Seems you're still strong even without your arm. But, you know, I don't really care about any of this. I just want to have a good time. Thanks to you, now I can. I won't forget that you helped me. I won't bother you anymore. Unless you bother me. Have fun in the mushroom forest. I have endured enough here without going insane. That reminds me, I'm extremely late to an appointment. See you around. What a nice guy. Are we in the mushroom forest? There was something about this place, but I can't remember. Mushroom Forest, that's where Gino's from. It's all coming back now. This is Gino's origin story. Funny. Actually, Monty Python taught me to not trust little white rabbits. There, little red one. You want to save? Yes. Damn, it's already been an hour. This has been fun so far. I wonder how long this game runs. I can't imagine it being more than like eight to ten hours, but it might be like a full twenty hour or more game. Spend too much time in the mushroom forest, you might change. Uh oh. Money. I should go back though. What's the worst that can happen? Those arrows. Huh. I am the guardian of the mushroom forest. There will come a time when we shall talk. It will not be tonight. Okay, I guess I slipped onto something that I shouldn't have. I think there's something over there, but I can't get to it. Okay. Alright, this is where I started. Loops around. Okay. Oh. Water. Oh, I see. I got a Naruto run across it. I can't just stop moving. Gotta have a full stride. Got it. Oh, it's a trap. You really stepped into something bad now. Nigel Thornberry? <laughs> I have finally caught the wooden pestilence. I'll make sure it won't be able to escape. With my defibrillatory stun gun, it will hurt a bit. 
I'm not going for a Nigel, I'm just going for my own. It will take months before we can use that stun gun again. We'd better make the best out of this opportunity. Grundle! Go pick it up! Bring it to the lair now, Grundle! Hurry up, you doofus! It's it's little it looks like Robotnik now that I look at it more. He's just Eggman. Eggman's cousin. Kinda reminds me of Dr. Wily from Mega Man. A little bit. What's up, Creeper Ninja? How's it going? You've missed a lot in an hour. I don't know if you've played this game at all before. But some weird shit happened. Um, I died once, came back to life. Uh, I found some doors in like multi dimensional travel. Um, there was a frog with like a banjo. Crazy. And a pig dude uh, tried to kill me. Just woke up and not played it. Well, you can always watch the VOD if you really want to, you know, watch, keep up with it, um, see what you missed, but, uh, yeah, this game so far is pretty damn fun, I've been streaming it for an hour, and, uh, it's called the Everhood, I've been hearing people say it's kind of like Undertale, and so far, yeah, I can definitely see the parallels, it was apparently inspired by Undertale, so that makes sense, um, but it's more, like, rhythmic based, and it's, like, kind of like a bit of platforming evasion, battle, RPG stuff. You'll see as I play, it, it's interesting. It's really fun so far though. I don't even want to talk about the things I have seen here. You can save your progress here. Do you want to save? Yes. Nice. Good luck getting out of here. Save point's always very jovial and conversational. Get out of our way. Step away or prepare for trouble. Okay, we got one of these now. Yep, so this is it. We got a dance floor, we gotta avoid shit. But yeah, this game came out like a few months ago, and... Surprised it hasn't gotten bigger yet. But, I'm sure it's probably only a matter of time till this game blows up. Seems like one of those games. That everybody will be talking about. Just know that I liked it before it was cool. Also, I'm playing on expert mode, apparently. This is this is the hardest difficulty, I guess. The nice thing is your HP recovers over time. So it's not so bad. You just have to survive. That's key. I'm sure later on they'll probably give me some method to attack back, but I don't know. It might just all be evasion. Alright. This man's hurt. Grrrg. Yes. Grandol is down. We beat him. Actually, let's save. And yeah, I look like freaking Gino, but red. Strange looking machine. You have awakened just in time. My masterpiece is about to be unleashed. I have constructed an artificial replication of an ancient creature. Its raw energy makes it so powerful that it can only exist for a limited time. Its only chance to bring you down and establish peace and once and for all. Prepare to face your doom, red mage. I guess I'm a red mage. I guess that, that's me. 
probably called me that before, I just wasn't paying attention. Oh, shit. They always just go right into it. And yeah, uh, epilepsy warning, by the way. I gave that earlier, but, you know. If you're epileptic, you probably shouldn't be watching a bunch of rave shit. Oh, that was his thing. What? How could you defeat my masterpiece so swiftly? Didn't even stand a chance. You are even more powerful than I imagined. There must be another way. We will meet again, Red Marauder. Door is shut tight. Okay. Yeah, this has like some Earthbound vibes. Definitely some Undertale vibes. Kind of reminds me a little bit of like Necrodancer too. In some ways, with the beat stuff. Pretty cool though. I appreciate games that are creative and, you know, bring some ingenuity to the pot, but also kind of have some notes of other inspiration. While still staying pretty unique. Ah, crazy man. They're everywhere. What do they want? Leave me be. I don't want to. Make it stop, 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 make it stop. Okay. Okay, crazy. Just stay there. Uh we'll turn that off for you. Wait, I wonder if he says anything if I turn How long must I endure? How long has it been? How long has it been? How long has it been? Who said that? Who's there? Stop laughing at me! Wow. Poor soul. So sorry for crazy Hallie. Haley. Might be a girl, actually. Uh-oh. Spooky big red eyes. Oh, that's probably just a machine. All of the circumstances are optimal. I have analyzed the triggering factors of what is considered a battle using quantum theory to artificially create a battle that is not considered a battle. You can't resort to your dirty tricks, Red Mage. This will be the end of you. Uh -oh. I get what he's talking about now. It's a battle that's not a battle. period. That usually means there's something bad coming. the end, right? Yeah. Remarkable. My efforts have proven futile once again. Is there anything that... Is there nothing that can stop you? 
I hope you find it in your heart to forgive my actions. I just want to find a solution. I walk away f for five seconds and come back to a rave. Nice. Yeah. Like I was saying, you missed a lot in an hour. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's an interesting game. This won't be the last time we meet Red Mage. Alright, see ya. Yeah, battles are kind of like bullet hells, but like rhythmic bullet hells, which is kind of cool. Picked up a big piece of a door. Okay. Thanos pig. Professor Orange has sent a message. They have failed to annihilate the doll. Good thing we moved back to my hideout. That doll cannot get its arm back. It's the crown jewel of my collection. Orange mentioned something else. The doll picked up at the blue door piece in Orange's lab before it left. What? And the doll has still not gathered the piece from the cursed castle. Nor the third piece. Wait! My emerald amulet is telling me the doll can hear us! It's using some sort of telepathic magic. How long has it been listening? I can disrupt the magic of desire, Golden Pig. Not another word. I'll do it myself. Oh, Pac-Man. Spooky ghosts. Hey, are you alright? He kinda zoned out there for a while. Okay, stuff's happening fast. Mushroom door, I hope you found something extraordinary. You can now return to your realm. Okay. Kermit's here. Enjoying ourselves, are we? This is quite a strange world. This realm has a way of cutting right to the interesting parts. It is natural because it becomes this way for immortals. I like it for what it is. I will be expecting many great things from you. It will get harder in ways you might not be able to imagine. But I shouldn't let you worry too much. Okay, thanks, Kermit. Alrighty then. Uh, we got wiggly blue or wiggly purple door that I haven't gone to yet. We got the gray door with like red aura. We got just black door. I already went to the blue door, um, and that's what made this thing pop up. I went to Shrek door already. It was just giggling. Oh, it's Bunny. All right, we'll go after Bunny later. I want to check the other doors first. Go to Black door. This door seems broken. Oh, that's what that's for. There, piece is missing. Yep. All right. Go to Wavy Midnight Town door. Hey, you fine piece, piece of craftsmanship. Wanna swing by Midnight Town? Nicest place around. Oh, is this gonna be 80s aesthetic? Hope not. Okay, no, it's not 80s aesthetic. It's colored. Weird. Wow. What is that clay pot you have? fit perfectly for something I had in mind. I will give you something valuable in return. That is a really annoying sound. <laughs> Could I have the clay pot? Yes. This feels great. I can take my old hat, or you can take my old hat. Picked up a frisbee looking hat. 
looks like a top of garbage thing. A rigidly locked chest. These flowers smell like childhood. Flowers smell like barbecue. These flowers smell like an old person's breath. Ugh. These flowers smell like something beautiful. Flowers smell skunky sweet. Like marijuana? Seem interested in that chest. For you only, I'll tell. Only the brown mage can unlock the golden lock, so I've heard. Okay. And I didn't check these flowers. These flowers smell like paper. These strange flowers smell like dirt. Nice, I got an achievement for that. Figured there was something special there. Oh, I see. Really need a roof for my home. Maybe I can give you some trash if you find me a roof. Do have some half-used toilet paper if that would be useful. Danny DeVito? Is that you? Hey, that circular fisbee looking thing would be perfect. As a roof for my house. What would you say if we traded my toilet paper for your hat, okay? This is a weird trade quest. Finally, a roof over my head. You won't be getting my toilet paper. Let's see. It's two. Haha. <laughs> Aw, oh, I got ripped off. Oh no, I'm fighting trash can. Fuck. Okay, just fighting garbage. Oh, it's a guitar. Spanish guitar. I can only take two hits before my health heals. That's crazy. Oh, it's got castanets now. Oh, it's like a green monster thing. I guess he's probably got a Spanish accent then, huh? Oh, jeez. I don't know how I dodged all that. Take the toilet paper. But I'm keeping the roof. Hey, toilet paper. Hi, small figure. I am Stone Guardian. I really like something, but I no move. Oh, you have food. Can I have cake? Yes. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum. Ah. This was bad cake. Thanks for nothing. I guess he said he liked to eat things. Okay, bye door. People needed him apparently. Up a hook. Okay. Wait. Went down here. And it goes back to the top. That's freaky. Check this out. I'm is only temporary. Oh, that's deep. Who's out there? Anyone is out there. I have an emergency. Did you get some toilet paper? Reward you with a lava lamp for your troubles. Just attach it to the hook and I will hoist it up. Yes. Ah. Yes. Finally, I can wipe my table clean. Oh. Oh, right. I promised you something. A lava lamp, right? Oh, no. I've got bad news. I seem to have lost it. 
if you bring me batteries, I promise to make something really, really unique and special. It's a super promise. Okay, gotta get batteries. I don't have batteries. Oh, wait, this, this is the same place. So if I just run, eventually it just returns me to the side. I see. It just loops around. Interesting. We'll go to Goldfish House. Blub. Beautiful metal thing is that. Blub. I would love to trade it. Blub. Want to trade? Blub. Or blub. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with blub. Blub. Wow, I look so cool. Blub. Here, take this. Um, just nice stick. I feel like we made a bad trade. Picked up a nice stick. Uh, I see. He wanted the hook. <laughs> and I put the hook in his mouth. He's not a fish. Blub, blub, hi there. I feel that I'm destined to do great things in my lifetime. Okay. Weird. Alright. Looks we go to party house now. Ah, oh, it's these guys. All my buddies. That I met before. Oh, this is a board game? Seems we're all finally here. Now, are you ready? Ready for an epic adventure? Yes. Oh, 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 good. Let me just... Set the mood. Let the adventure begin. Once upon a time in the land of Medallion, there was a village whose name had been forgotten. The little town was settled with happy, hard-working villagers. But beyond that lake, deep in the darkness, stood a tower so tall that it reached the clouds. The villagers could see the mysterious lights and shadows moving at the top of the tower. Fearing that an evil wizard had taken hold of the tower, the townspeople hoped for a hero to save them from their presumably ill fate. Within the village was a temple that protected an ancient relic capable of withstanding evil. The sword that deflects red attacks. Really? That's a really dumb name. I find it quite descriptive. Guys, please don't interrupt. Alright, we're playing D&D. I get it. During a dark, rainy night, a warrior entered the temple. Oh, that's me. Oh, great warrior, take this sword. Our most valuable relic. Oh, it's it's the mushroom, sorry. Make wish all the evil. Save our small village. Receive this sword and gain its powers of deflecting red attacks. <gasps> Gasp. With this power, you might be able to face the evil wizard. Now, before you leave... <laughs> Give me all your treasures. Or pay with your lives! Oh, great warrior, we are helpless. Save us from this foul bandit. Ah, oh, okay. Why won't you just die? That's a little hard. Oh yeah, I killed him. Ah, you have bested me. That wasn't too hard. 
You, you saved us, oh great warrior. Hooray! Hooray. Hooray. Now, the case to the tower and defeat the evil wizard. All the mushrooms. Their silly voices. Our warrior had a quest. Little did the warrior know what terrible challenges were ahead. Uh, this seems like such a waste of time. We could be doing something more important, Red. Why should Red listen to someone called Thief? What? I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm glad you're the warrior, Red. Alright. I went too far. <laughs> so you're gonna be that kind of player, huh? Doing the opposite of the suggested narrative? I can assure you that there is nothing of importance in the village. What about freedom of choice, Green? Maybe Red wants to go back to the village for something else. Red decided to walk back to the village, but suddenly... A tree snapped and fell in the way, blocking the route back to the village. That felt a bit forced. Yes. Save cow. Moo! The lamp pretending to be a cow. I got it. Someone who, who's played DD, this is pretty, pretty tongue in cheek. I like it. It's fighting a. Okay. Hey there, Red. You want your quest to slay the evil wizard? See, that is also my quest. Guy has terrorized these villagers too long. I see you got the sword that deflects red attacks. I am not relying on any steel. My weapons are my fists. Oh, cool, we got a monk. Just out of curiosity. Would like to engage in some friendly sparring to see which of us is the strongest? Your sword versus my fists? Sparring battle? Yes. Alright, let's see who is truly the strongest. Maybe I shouldn't have taken on the monk. Monks are kind of OP on one on one. Not so much for crowd control, but they're definitely good at singling bosses out. Therefore. Got him. Wow. You have some impressive moves. I have to practice harder. Time to beat the evil wizard before you. you Wanna battle again? I think I've had enough. You're not gonna join me? Okay. Help me, Red. This game is too hard. I got attacked by squirrels. You help me up? Yes. Thanks a bunch. This time I will not fail. Thanks for helping me, Red. Okay. Something got hurt. You dare enter my domain? 
I have been commanded to not let a soul pass this bridge. If you are to cross, prepare to pay with your life. Uh oh. Black Knight. Sort of way. What is this freaking? Okay, I need to stop like, chasing after them. Just get them if they're in my path. Shit. Before the, the loop really just kicked in. You got some dank moves. With such great powers, I sure hope you're a good aligned character. Okay, he just jumped into the river. The warrior had proven their skills twice. Their confidence was high, which would be needed. The swamp of Chaos challenged the warrior to their very core. The Swamp of Chaos? Isn't that swamp level a bit cliché? What's next, the sewer level before the tower? No. It's, it's actually... The Badlands of Chaos. You don't have a ch have to change the entire level because Zig... No, it's fine. I was obviously kidding that there was a swamp level. This is better. Eh. Uh-oh. Badlands of Chaos. Just stuff. Honestly, the graphics in this level are very ugly. It really looks unfinished. Well, that's what you get. Just say it so you can make it better. Mm. Hello, fellow adventurer. I had gathered equipment specifically for the swamp. Antidote potions, camouflage armor, a sword to cut nasty vegetation terrain. Due to the recent update of this level, I had to throw it all away. It was getting too warm in these scorching badlands. Oh well. I guess I found a use for this nice hat. Sorry for rambling. Anyway, do you want to save? Yes. All the best of luck to ye! It's just... It sounds like it was just hastily put together. Stop hitting me! Only if you give me all your items. Clan, is that you? Didn't see it. This is my custom-made mech character from Gear Assault. This fantasy game is way easier with a mech. I also noticed that attacking other players gives me more loot. This must be breaking several game rules. Hmm. <laughs> I'll have to check the rule book. Hold on, you play a good character, don't you, Red? Uh-oh. In that case... Green? Hand over all your items. Or fear the wrath of Chaos the Sixth. Alright. Shit. 
shit. I died. Got him. No cheating allowed. This game is hard. Oh no, it's this song. It is a mystery. I play a good guy, I lose. I play a bad guy, I lose. Here we go. I found a rule about PvP combat. Oh. I guess you guys solved it already. That was really what, not what we were concerned about. The show must go on, little one. <laughs> that music. I guess that is public domain. How am I supposed to win when I keep losing? Muck keeps telling me failure is the progress that paves the road to success. But to me, failure just seems like failure. I guess I just have to think of another way to win the game. I can't believe I was steamrolled by Flan. I should really retire. An inn or become a merchant. Anything but a hero. Alright. Finally, at the foot of the tower. The lair of the wizard. Will you be able to save the village in its ill fate? Or from its ill fate? This is actually becoming quite exciting. You could do it, Red. I guess if anyone has a chance to win, it's you. If we defeat the evil wizard, we can win the game. I am the cursed save point. There is a 50% chance that I'll delete your save. Lucky for you to have several save slots. <laughs> you take your chances, yes. Your save... was... <laughs> deleted! Ha 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 ha! Uh oh. But seriously, your game was saved. Yeah, okay. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Alright, I'm gonna be right back again. I'm drinking too much because I'm hurting my throat too much, and then I have to go to the bathroom too much. That's how this is working.
Okay, I'm back. I'm going to play this till I finish the board game and then I'm going to call it a night. Got a lot of stuff I got to do tomorrow. A nice stick that produces nice swooshing sounds when swung around. I guess I didn't read all the descriptions of these. I can't use them here. I guess it makes sense. I'm in a game. I shouldn't be able to use anything I have. I'm in a game within a game. You have come a very long way, warrior. I see that you are armed. You are not the first they have sent to assassinate me. Isn't that right, Rasta Beast? The villagers just fear what they don't understand, you see. Don't listen to the evil wizard, Red. Oh, shut up, Rasta. I don't have time for this, and you heroes are bothering me. Your death will serve as an example for anyone who would even dare consider disturbing me. Okay then. Too greedy sometimes. Yourself. I am the one who hears God. Wow. It's like typical JRPG boss, yeah. Yeah, I got him. Easy. Are you so strong? Uh, can't believe I was beaten by a wooden doll wearing a metal bucket. One day I will have my revenge. Uh. Thank you for saving me, Red. I wouldn't have made it if it wasn't for you. We fought valiantly. Let's go back to the village and tell them the good news. Now that the quest has come to an end, Red and Rasta Beast journeyed back to the village, silhouetted by a glorious sunset. Once returned, they were received as heroes for defeating the evil wizard. What about that tree that was blocking the root? And so. opened a bakery where they sold slimy muffins, which proved to be quite a success. Zig decided to make the tower their home, where Zig lived happily ever after, or at least for a long time. And Nosferatu, 
Wait, you weren't in the game at all? I wanted to roleplay as one of the mushrooms. Nosferatu continued the unfruitful quest of trying to learn the secrets of his past. Yes. Okay. So what did you guys think? That was a good session, Green Mitch. I've played better. I enjoyed it as well, even if it was a bit hard. I guess this is it. But actually, for your great efforts of saving the land of Medallion Red, Take this tributal piece of wood as a reminder of this epic quest. Oh, wow. I'm sure it'll come in handy. Yes, picked up a piece of a door. Well played, Red. It was an adventure. It seems like you have a hidden talent. You played it as if it wasn't your first time. I assure you it was. What a great story. I'm glad we were finally able to finish the game. Well, I guess it's finished. Good job. Sorry. I thought the ending was disappointing. He saved Medallion. Hey, what are you doing? That is strictly private. That's just tight shut. Shut tight. Can't seem to get it open. Villagers are eternally grateful for your courage, determination, and strength to save the land of Medallion. Okay, that's it. Nope, nothing more. As goofy as this game looks, the beats are actually pretty neat, right? It's definitely a quirky game. Did I get any. This guy wanted batteries, that's right. Also, the music changed here. Ah. Door is locked. Of course it is. Shop guy has anything for me? No. Yeah, I mean, this game is only 10 bucks. And if you want the soundtrack, I think it's like an extra five. All right, I guess that's all I can do here, as far as I know. Actions speak louder than words. Where you can help others, you must help yourself, okay? Sometimes it can be good to interact with the same character twice. Some individuals get nervous when you stay quiet. They might share some juicy information. Do you want to save? Yes. Keep it real, dude. You can do it, Red. this door. Hello, I hope you had a great time. I want to go back to dancing. Uh, did I do this one? Mm, oh yeah, this was that place with all the burnt stuff. That's just where I came from. Maybe I can... Yeah, maybe I can go back and maybe there's some more here. See? Sometimes they give you a little, uh, stuff for... Okay, no, nothing new. It's all old. I'm sure there's probably lots of secrets in this game, though. Kind of like Undertale. I don't want to just sit here and compare it to that the whole time, but... 
All right, I'm gonna go make some coffee and go hit up some training mode in SC for a bit. All right, dude. I was actually gonna call it myself here. I was just exploring a bit more before I decided to call it. Yeah, have a good one, dude. Thanks for watching. And uh, this game's, like I said, 10 bucks on Steam if you wanna try it yourself. It's fun. So, yep, thanks all you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good night.